You have the mountain top as your goal. You have reached the summit, the realm of the eagle. But before admitting, you must honor this membership, and we must first hear your story of the long climb along the trail. You learn first the scout skills as you climb through the scout ranks of scout, tenderfoot, second class, and first class. After receiving the first class rank, you have worked diligently in a Scott expert who gave you valuable counsel on many subjects. Then additional merit badges allowed you to become a star scout, while still more found you wearing the heart of a life scout. <coughs> many more moons have passed, while harder requirements found you adding the secure qualifications until you have achieved scouting's highest rank, Eagle. You have worked to this point where you are about to become an Eagle. Listen first to the wisdom of the four winds. I, in the spirit of the East Wind, I represent the common law, your duty to God and the country. Trustworthy, loyal, and helpful are the qualities which a man must possess who lives by the laws and rules of this land. See that we do not lose this great blessing of a lawful land. As the spirit of the West Wind, I represent the law of equity, the duty to country and others. Other friendly, courteous, and kind are the laws that breathe conscience. They create the atmosphere that comes from within your heart. The desire for you always to be a friend to those of all ages, young and old alike. Cour courteous to those who pass along your trail. Pass away the harmful spirit of unfriendliness and selfishness. I am the spirit of the South Wind. I represent the civil law, your duty to others, and self. Obedient, cheerful, and thrifty are the characteristics of civil law. A life of cheerful obedience is necessary for, for the development of a true citizen. Obedience is something everyone has to learn. Take orders and carry them out cheerfully. Real thrift means earning, spending wisely, and saving. You share with those less fortunate. I am the spirit of the North Wind, the most powerful of all. I re represent the divine law, brave, clean, and reverent. To be brave is to be unselfish. To be clean in body and soul is to be pure in heart. Cast from your mind and body any evil spirit that tries to weaken or destroy the divine law. Live a life of reverence. Be brave and clean. Throughout the climb up the sky trail, the badges you have earned have changed in your ability to grow. But one pledge remained unchanged, the scout oath. Now candidate, make the scout sign, and state the scout oath, slowly and clearly, to renew this promise, which you first made many years ago. On my honor, I will do my best to do my duty to guide my country, and to obey the scout law. To help other people at all times and to keep myself physically strong, mentally awake, and morally straight. This court recognizes Peter John Jensen as fully qualified for the rank of Eagle Scout. He should understand that the Eagle Scout rank is a responsibility as well as an honor. You have reached the summit of the mountain, the highest rank in scouting. You may soar with the Eagles, for you are now one of them. To ensure that you understand that being an eagle is a responsibility as well as an honor, the four winds will now explain to you the responsibilities of an eagle scout before the badge is awarded. <coughs> 